Hello and welcome to the Cornwall Reports news briefing for Wednesday the 5th of January, the local media headlines today. So it's official. Cornwall's Covid infection rate is now so serious that only a few months ago the government was putting us into special measures and declaring that we needed an enhanced response to the virus. Things are now getting worse each day. The hospitals are filling up rapidly and I forecast it won't be long before we see schools closing. But members of parliament are only today getting round to talking about it. I think we can guess what this evening's news will be about. There are only seven days to go before Richard Branson tries his next satellite launch. But will he be launching rockets from Cornwall this summer? There's a mountain of work that needs to be completed first. And in a sign of these Covid staycation holiday times, another farm in Cornwall is looking to cash in with a planning application to become a campsite. The BBC reported on the rescue of a seal pup which had become entangled in rope and nets near Pendeen. Rescue divers were able to reach the animal and cut it free. Pirate FM covered the Cornwall Wildlife Trust report which said 170 dolphins and other mammals had washed up on our beaches last year. The Falmouth Packet told us how a Helston theatre group has raised the cash to help support the building they perform in. The Cornish Times looks forward to a referendum in Calstock on the local neighbourhood development plan. And finally, Cornwall Live looks forward to some big waves. And those are the local media headlines for now. Thank you very much for watching. Do please share this video on social media. I'll be back again tomorrow. See you then. Bye bye.